Arkansas's Republican delegation denounced the actions of protesters storming the Capitol as well. All Arkansas U.S. Senators and Representatives tweeted their response to the rioters, some of them even tweeting while in lockdown. So Representative Steve Womack says it was a heartbreaking day for the country as the symbol of freedom and democracy was under attack. Here we are with thousands and thousands of people breaking into the Capitol, uh, trespassing, uh, in a, in a very uncivil way, trying to make a point that uh, that they were not happy with the outcome of the election and the process it was unfolding. So, yeah, it was a, a, a very sad day for me. Representative Womack was also unsatisfied with President Trump's response, saying it was inadequate and unfortunate. And reactions continue to come in from other local political leaders. Uh, Governor Asa Hutchinson also weighing in, saying yesterday's events on Twitter. To see protesters in our nation's capital invading the halls of Congress and disrupting the peaceful transfer of power is reprehensible. Senator Tom Cotton said the violence is unacceptable and needs to be met with full force of the law. God bless the Capitol Police who are keeping us safe. And Senator John Bozeman also called for an end to the destruction, saying the violence and destruction taking place at the Capitol is unacceptable and must cease. And former president and governor of Arkansas, Bill Clinton, said we must reject violence, turn the page, move forward together, honoring our Constitution, remaining committed to the government of the people, by the people, and for the people.